Okay, y'all, so I just made it to Atlanta. Now I'm finna go to baggage claim and get my stuff. I can't lie, y'all, my flight took so long. I was so irritated. I'm just gonna go home. I'm just gonna try to hurry up and get out of here. I'm vlogging for my camera right now. That's how the light in the place. Your first time going to Georgia. But yeah. yeah. Let me go to the next plane now and have a try to get my stuff. But ghetto yeah, I got my bonnet on, like. Let me get this thing out of here. Yeah, try to fix the camera. I think I go this way. But yeah, I was supposed to get wheelchair assistance because, I don't want to say why, but I was supposed to get wheelchair assistance. And I just feel like it's gonna take too long and I just really wanna go home. And I still gotta do my hair when I get there, so. Southwest Airlines is currently boarding flight 491 with service to Memphis and Park Avenue C10, paging Ronald, Haley, Sharon, Haley, English. I'm gonna do my hair. Give me home right now. And they really be jumping in here. Like, why is all these people here? Then I'm trying more to just send myself by recording. I already got this bonnet on. I just need to hurry up and get the baggage claim. I'll come back when I get there. Okay, uh, now I found it. I went in for my bags to come. This is my mom, y'all. Say hi to my mom. Wanna say hi? Get me off the camera. Y'all, she don't want to be on camera. Excuse her. She don't mean no harm. But um, yeah, I'm ready for my bags to come now, and I'm gonna go home because I'm tired. And I just wanna get in the bed and get in the shower and relax. So yeah, I'll be back later. All right, child, I'm back. I miss my bed so much, y'all. Let me just jump in it, like. Oh shit. I ain't got to be it for that. Why does this look so yellow? Hold on. Okay, that's a lot better. Okay. Yeah, I miss my bed so much. It's just sitting here all nice and pretty for me. And I also miss my vanity, y'all. Because <laughs> this is where the best faces get done. Like, honestly. As you can see. I got my boy up there. Some of my shoes. I haven't had these shoes in months, y'all. I forgot I even had those. I never even wore these before. They're so cute, though. I probably won't ever wear them, to be honest. Probably just keep them for you know these are gonna beat up. I need another pair. Got 
these up in here. I literally never wear these, like, ever. Ever. I don't know why I got them, to be honest. But yeah, I miss my clothes and all my stuff so much, like, so much. All this, like, winter stuff. All this stuff just looks so... I need to go shopping. I need to get rid of all this stuff and get more clothes. To be honest. Here go all my sweatpants and sweatsuits and all that good stuff. Y'all know I love a sweatsuit. I don't care how hot it is. I'm going to throw a sweatsuit on. So I went to Wendy's and I got some food. I'm finna eat that. Here go to die. My mom only going to get one because I can't lie. I like to overdo stuff. They got my blow dryer. All my stuff down here. I got my love. And I'm not gonna lie. I'll probably be in like Sephora and Target. I need to do a haul. Y'all yeah, don't know nothing about this. This is the Shea Collection. This is my brand. I'm gonna be dropping it soon, y'all. But basically, this is for my brand. It's called the Shea Collection. Flat irons. Hot tools, hot combs, blow dryers. Here go the blow dryers right here. These are the hot combs. And they work so good, y'all. They're so bomb. I can't even talk. Okay. Those are clothes that need to be put away, obviously. And, yeah, let me go boil some hot water so I can go ahead and dye this hair. And then I'm going to try to hop in the shower. I'll be back, y'all. Yeah. Y'all, yeah, I'm at Sephora. And my mom's having some, you gonna vlog with a bonnet on your head? Do y'all care? If y'all don't want me to have a bonnet on, tell me. But I'm ghetto. I don't care. Sephora. No. And I don't even know what I want. They got so much good stuff. Get a couple things and I do the most. I don't like these little spin around things. I'm not going through there. I gotta come back because I can't get copyrighted. Okay, y'all, now I'm at Target. I accidentally got too much stuff at Sephora, but I knew I was gonna happen anyway because I have a problem. And I don't know how to fix it. But um, 
now I'm about to be toxic again and come to Alta in here and see what I can find, y'all, because I feel like I just need stuff. Like, I need stuff. Maybe like a new eyeshadow palette. And it's 30% off. Like, is that God talking to me? I don't think they have the one I want, though. Yeah, I couldn't find what I wanted for real, so I just got these brushes. And now I need some facial soap, whatever that is. The music is allowing me not to be able to record. So I yeah, I just got back home from going to the store. I hope I'm not ghetto to y'all right now by wearing this body because I really don't feel like taking it off. Like, it's a lot going on <laughs> up under there. And I don't feel like doing my hair right now, so I hope the bomb is cool. I just wanted to show y'all what I got from Sephora, though, and what I got from Target. I ended up not being able to get that much from Target. And I wasn't supposed to get all this from Sephora, but I'm going to show y'all what I got. So first I got this and Krista told me it smells so good. I haven't even smelled this yet, but I just, I can feel that it smells good. So I bought it. Um, I can't wait to smell it though. I had to get it. Then, honestly, I be looking for the makeup products that the people be using when I get my makeup done because I feel like I be wanting to, you know, stick with them products. And I think I seen her using this. I don't know though. Let me see. I don't even be knowing the colors either. Like I just be guessing. Yes, I think this is it y'all. So it's basically like a powder foundation. At first I was going for like a more wet dewy look, but I think if I'm going for like makeup, like I wanna look like I got my actual makeup done, I can go for like a powdery look. But, like, on a natural day, I could go for the oily look. But that's my problem right there. I be, like, not sticking to the same routine. But, yeah, I got this in. Oh, shit. <laughs> in shade 450. It don't really have a name on there. Yeah, I just say 450. Then I got another one in 385. This is, like, the lighter one. I think it's more on my cuff. <laughs> Y'all talk about I got bronchitis. Whoa, damn. Oh, it come with a little powder. A little thing at the bottom. That's nice. And a little mirror. I hope this is the right color for me. I should have got a lighter color, too. I'll probably go back and get a lighter color, too. Okay. And then... I got this blush. It comes with a cream blush and a powder blush. I didn't really want this color, I'm not gonna lie, but they didn't have the other one. And then she talked about something you can come back tomorrow. I'm not even a come back tomorrow type of girl. Like, I'm a right now or never. Cause I just like, you know, handling my business right then and there. So I just got this shade and honestly the other she's a doll it was kind of bright and i don't want to really give like i want to give like natural natural cute little blush added you know okay let me show y'all i don't even know how to get it open oh there we go so I still think this is like a pretty shade and it's not too bright. Like the other one gives Barbie. This one gives like more chill, calm, cool go. I got this one instead. This is my first time using a brand, but the packaging is cute. Like this little thing is cute. I don't like how it's getting my fingerprints all over it already, but let me just put it back in the box. Okay. Let's see what else. I also got this setting spray. It's, say it's supposed to last all night. Hopefully it do last all night. Because I plan on being outside. My excuse for getting all this stuff, y'all, is my birthday coming up. And I'm trying to get ready for my birthday. This isn't like a big setting spray, but I really like this brand. Like, 
I love Charlotte. So I got this one. I hope it works good. And y'all, I usually never use setting spray like ever for some reason. I don't know why. I just be going. And my makeup be staying on sometimes. Then I got some more Born This Way concealer. I already had one right here, but this was like a different color. This is Latte, and I got Golden Beige this time. And I did need to go a little lighter, because as you can see, this one is like a, it's like really close to my skin color. And I feel like I needed to go lighter in this brand. This one is a lot lighter. Let me compare the two. Well, it wasn't that, that much lighter, but it's a difference. And then I already have this elf one. I try to get the lightest in this, like, because I'd be liking a bright under eye sometimes. So I might end up like mixing all three together. I don't even know yet. And everything was like $30 each. I'm not going to lie. That's exactly why I don't like Sephora, because why is everything so expensive? But um, you be having to invest in your makeup. But honestly, I feel like you can get the same results buying an e.l.f. Like, I have a lot of e.l.f. products also. Like, I use this concealer, and it's actually pretty good. And I use the brow lift also. And then I got some blush from there, too. I don't really like this blush. I'm not going to lie. I don't like the cream blush from there. That's why I got this Patrick kind but yeah, hopefully I can learn how to do my makeup like the makeup artists be doing it because I'm such a do-it-yourself type of person. I be wanting to learn and do it on my own so I don't have to depend on nobody for nothing. Then it'd be a lot like the last girl who did my makeup, she all the way in Houston. Like, what if I need to do my makeup and I'm in another state? Then I got to go book a whole nother, like, it just be too much. I want to be able to do it myself and so I don't have to depend on nobody. I was trying to get some more blush. What no highlighter from Real Beauty? Cause look at my eyes. Oh, it's about to spill. Look at it, y'all. It broke, and it just looks so. Uh, I need more, but they were sold out, so I couldn't get no more. So I'm gonna have to figure out where they sell it at. This shirt is so big, like. I don't even know what I'm doing, y'all. I just was just uncomfortable to go outside. I really wasn't supposed to do much. But um, now we're going to get to Target. So from Target, I got some some Real Technique brushes. Because I really needed some. And I feel like these are like the most affordable, but get the job done. You know? So I got these ones. I got this powder brush. Because I got the powder foundation, and I feel like this will help, like, blend it in. And I think these ones are, like, more for, like, foundation and concealer. And I got some more face soap because I'm almost out. Favorite. Get the job done. If I was you, I would go and get it. Like, this needs to be in your skincare routine. If it's not, you're tripping. I love this. Like, I probably will never use anything else. It's just so gentle on my skin, and, like, it really has been getting the job done. I'm not going to lie. And then, I saw a lot of people talking about this EOS lotion. This is my first time getting EOS lotion. I be using the shaving cream, and I like the shaving cream, so I'm like, I'm going to try it. And then everybody was saying it smells so good. This is the only kind they had, so I got this raspberry kind. But it does smell really good. And I just love taking a nice hot shower, getting out, skin soft, rubbing some nice lotion on your body. And then I'm going to spray a little bit of this too. And yeah, like, <laughs> no, I just went like that. But yeah, I, I got to clean my brushes because all of my brushes are dirty as hell. And... It be taking the quality away from the brushes when you don't clean them often. So I need to clean all my brushes and yeah. And then I've been using this makeup bag right now. It's giving, hell no. Nah. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go back to using this. 
The only thing is, like, I used to carry this through the airport, but this was when I was talking to Jay. And Jay, he used to carry it through the airport for me. And now I'm going to have to carry it for myself. And I don't want to. That's one thing about him. He was a gentleman. And you didn't have to ask. If I was trying to hold this shit myself, uh oh, give me that. I don't know what this is in here, but yeah, I'll probably put all my makeup back in here and um, start taking this to the airport. Unless I can get that bag rejuvenated. I got a couple more makeup bags too, though, because I'm just addicted to buying stuff. Probably get the wash on my brushes. I can do that. I got some new ones too. I be buying a lot of brushes and then some of them be going missing and stuff. Like, I hate that. I'm probably going to put them all together. This is a little big, like, I don't really see what this one is going to do for real. Because I got a brush just like it. But this one is like a more expensive one. This is, I think I got this from Ulta. Yeah, Ulta. And this is a pretty good brush, too. I just need to clean them all so they can all work to its full potential, you know? Because I feel like dirty brushes, they don't even be getting the job done like they're supposed to. You got to clean your brushes. I just be on the go 24-7. I don't be having time to do stuff like that. But I think these brushes is going to be fire, especially when it comes to like applying my foundation. Hell yeah. Y'all need to go get these. Hell yeah. I shit all over my shirt, like, it help me. Okay, so, yeah, I really like these real technique brushes. Y'all definitely should go and invest in these because I already know this is going to come in handy when I'm blending under my eye concealer. Hell, yeah. This going to be fire. And i probably use this one for, like, eyebrow, maybe. I don't really like this one too much. I ain't gonna lie. And then this, I don't know what this is for. But it's soft. And I like it, so. Win. That was definitely a good purchase. Okay. So I'm probably gonna go wash my brushes. I'll probably be back after I wash my brushes, y'all. But yeah. I got my lights up there. Nice size bed. Now, y'all, I think I'm going to straighten up a little bit because, like, look at all my clothes right here. And honestly, I don't even have no room for my clothes anywhere because I have too much stuff. Like, too much stuff. I'm running out of space. I think I just need to get some of my stuff away, y'all, because I don't even wear everything. Like, just being a honey. There's some stuff in there that I will honestly never touch, like, ever. So, I don't even know why I have it. I never showed y'all my tattoo. I'm finna show y'all. I got hair all in my back from in the shower. Oh, fuck no. Uh, they said, Corinna, why would you get a gun on your back? Why not get a gun on your back? Like, not gonna lie. It was a very bold fucking thing to do, but I like it. <laughs> I like it. Shit. And then somebody said, what if something happened? Why are they gonna be looking at my back anyway? Unless somebody tell them that I got that, because, like, how would they even know? Y'all gotta be looking hard. Like, why are you even looking at my tattoo? So, okay, hey, y'all. I just got out of the shower and tried to attempt to fix my hair, y'all. It kind of looks bad, but I just got to go with it for now because I don't know what else to do to it. But today I plan on going to the store and getting some stuff. I really just want to start shopping for my birthday because I think it's like a month away today, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see. Hell yeah, <laughs> a month away today, don't play with it.
I hope this month flies by, honestly, but in a good way. Because I'm ready to be outside. I'm ready to put my outfit on, put that shit on. I need to book a photographer like ASAP for a fucking photo shoot. And yeah. Okay, so I'm finna go to the store and figure out what I wanna get. Hopefully they have nice stuff. I forgot what I was saying. I'll be back. Choose the words, what it will 